Perhaps best known for his role as the vain, arrogant, but lovable, of course, lovable doctor in Green Wing. We've got Stephen Mangan here with us. Now, Stephen has just got involved in a Channel 4 new comedy. So it starts on Friday. Free agents. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us a little bit about the show? Not just involved. It's been, this has been going for a while, this one. About three years ago, we did three a years. reading. Yeah, in a sort of seedy Soho uh, room. Um, with the writer and the producer. I think I was the only cast member from that reading that's still involved. And then we did a pilot a couple of years ago, which I think was shown last year on the Comedy Showcase. And uh, we got the go-ahead for the series. So yeah, it's been, it's, been, um, it's been out there for a while, but now the series is ready. And uh, we filmed it at the end of last year. Uh, I was, it's all, it was all a bit of a blur, the filming. I was in the theater at the same time. So I was filming during the day and rushing to the theater at night doing a play seven days a week so um, I have no idea what happens in the series I can't remember it all passed in a blur of of tiredness and a lot of weeping so wrap it up in a little nutshell it's a romantic minus the tears romantic <laughs> will they won't they comedy drama zombie gore no it's a, it's a will they won't they series but we do you right. do oh yeah right at the beginning first scene we are and do you do it again? Well, this is the thing. That's the will they, won't they bit. Do will they, they have do sex it again? again? That, I mean, is that a, mo a modern phenomenon, do you think? <laughs> you have sex first, and then you spend the next six episodes, or six weeks if you're a real person, <laughs> not in TV land, uh, trying to work out if you can have a relationship with each other. So, the, yeah, the sex comes first, and then it, it's like, what are we doing? Is that how it works these days? Well, apparently. I mean, I'm happily married, so I wouldn't know. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. know. Yeah, that isn't it? No, actually, no, you're right. <laughs> it's not like that. It's not like that. But, you know, obviously, big theme of love, mm. romance. Yeah. And, you know, the big day isn't that far away. The big day? The big day, Valentine's. Oh, Valentine's, yeah. Valentine's next Saturday. So, what's the most romantic thing you've ever done? Wow. I suppose ask my wife to marry her. Was, must be the most yeah. romantic thing. How, how did you do that? Well, we were in Ireland, on the west coast of Ireland, and it was a... Uh, we were on a beach, the sun was setting, the waves were crashing in, a completely empty beach. We were walking along, I was very nervous, I took her hand, I turned to her, we stopped. And just at that moment, two very fat women in lycra came jogging out of the dunes, right past her eye line. And Louise said, oh, and I said, that's all right, nothing. <laughs> so I didn't ask her then, but uh, I did ask her uh, the next day, uh, on a cliff. Oh, lovely. Yeah. And so, you know... I thought if she said no, I could just, you know... No! <laughs> Let's just forget this never happened. <laughs> so, uh, talking about romance, you know, watching the show, there is one moment in the show where, you know, it's maybe happened to a few of us when men have perhaps broken down post-sex, crying, you know, right. one of those embarrassing moments. Right. you ever had such a moment or uh... anything? In that kind of league. God, wow, that is that is a re <laughs> really gone in straight in for the d Come deeply on, personal. Come on, you know, it's, it's made a show like this. You've got to bear your soul, really. You know, uh, a bit of love. No, I don't think I've ever done what Alex, my character, does, which is, I mean, for a start, he's going through a big divorce. Yeah. So he is messed up in a big way. Uh, and I have never been upset about anything in my whole life, so I'm fine. That's no, a lie. Uh, <laughs> I don't know, oh, gosh. Well, you know, sexes can be a very um, emotional thing, can't it? Yeah, it can be. Have can you ever be. cried during before or after sex? Sure. Regularly. There you go. 